Good morning, brothers and sisters, and welcome to the Sunday sermon of our Church of Change. We are gathered here today to talk about what matters most. Some of you participated in our confessional booth this weekend to talk about your values. Our booth wouldn't be confessional if we didn't explore situations in which those values don't always persevere. We would like to take this time to thank all the participants for their open and heartfelt confessions. There was a common thread to the values which are most important in our booth during the ACDC. We heard kindness a lot, curiosity, compassion and empathy, openness and faith. The two values that were omnipresent in our talks relating to work were honesty and being real. And if we have learned anything in working with values these past 15 years is that it's people value the things that they need the most. Almost every confession came down to one thing, the challenge to the modern day change professional is to, cha is to stay true to themselves while the workplace tries to force them into an unnatural systemic role. It seems to us that companies like the feeling of a change agent on the payroll, but not the real change that could come with it. The one thing change agents can't seem to effectively address is the culture in which companies can grow to be more human. Why is that? The chains holding us back are familiar ones. Mortgages to be paid, family to be provided for, careers to advance. Who are we without our C-suite clients? It's hard not to confuse a $200 hourly wage with a reward for being you. So brothers and sisters, are we doomed to a lifetime of dehumanizing work? Is the fear of a professional abyss enough to stifle any thoughts of speaking up or making a stand? Do we cast ourselves into the agonizing pits of management to become chief executors of fire, operational officers of brimstone? It seems that we are willing to sell our souls for an hourly wage on a corporate highway to hell. Thus concludes the dark part of our sermon. Now we head towards the light. Thank you very much for listening to us. I'm not sure if you can see us or hear us. Yep, we can hear you. Mic's on? Yep, all good. Thank you very much. We have uh, taken the liberty of, um, uh, of putting the sermon in uh, text. We're and going to share it with you, and you can read it again. Maybe feel inspired sometime down the road. And uh, one of the fun things is this looks an awful lot like a booth, but we're going to we're gonna do the big reveal now. Reveal. Uh... <laughs> Yeah, it's just a piece of uh, plywood that we put in front of. <laughs> Hello, welcome. <laughs> Finally, you get to see our faces, huh? Yeah, yeah. The living room. Hey, guys. Hi. So Thank, nice you so Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I hope you guys enjoyed that.